Hi, I am Roxana from VP Estate and in this video I will show how to set a hero header with the VP Rentals team available options. The hero header is the section below the menu and with team available options you can add an image like you can see on this page, a video, you can set a team slider that will display your listings, you can set a map or create a slider with Revolution Slider plugin. In the team you will find the option to set the header type globally or individually per page or post. The global option can be found in team options, general, header, media header type. This is the option that you can use if you wish to set the same header on all pages. In this video I will describe each header type by setting it individually on one page. In our demos we use on home page a header set custom. The steps that I show now can be used to change the demo header easily after the import or set the header on new pages. The settings for header type can be found in the backend of the page. In order to access the backend you can click on edit page or go to admin, pages, look for the page that you wish to edit and press edit. You will need to scroll to appearance options in this section. Here along with header type option you will have the option to set or not transparent header only on this page. If you open the header type drop down you will see that the first option is the global one. If this option will be selected, it means that the header type that you set in team options will apply. The next option is none. When selected, no header will show. I will select none. Press update. And the page will start directly with the content and no header will be displayed. If image header is selected, you will need to upload your image. I will show. You need to select an image from your device. Insert into post. Next, you can set the image to be full screen. You can set the image to cover or contain. The cover option will display the image as background. The contain option will use the original size of the uploaded image, but you might have borders near the image. From here you can add a title over the image and a subtitle. You can set the image height, an overlay color and the color opacity. After the settings are saved, on home page you will have an image set as header. Next we have team slider. For this type you will not have any settings in the back end of the page as you will need to set it in team options, general, team slider. Here you will select the listings that will show in team slider. You can add them by ID as well. Here you add the rotation speed and in design type you can choose between the two design types that we have available. This is the team slider design type 1. I will select type 2. And this is the design of type 2. The slider will display the featured image of each listing selected in Team Options. The next header type is Revolution Slider. Once selected, here you will need to add the name of the slider created with Revolution Slider plugin. The Revolution Slider plugin is one of the included plugins. You can find it here. You can create new sliders or import the demo ones. 
I will show an example on how to import demo sliders. You need to click on manual import. I have here the team pack files unzipped in for the revolution slider demo. You will find the demo sliders. I will select one to show how it will work. Now you will need to edit the slider and alias is the name that you will need to add in the backend of the page. I will paste it here, save. Now on home page you will have one of the demo revolution sliders. Next you can set a map as header. When you set maps, the coordinates of landing point need to be added. I will add some random ones. If you do not need a custom landing point, you can leave blank and the coordinates from team options will apply. Also, the map zoom level can be set. You can also set the map at closed size and set height when open and height when closed. For this header type, I recommend to disable the transparent header as it will not show well. Now the map will show in header. When you use maps in your site, you will need to decide on the map system that you wish to use. The team has available OpenStreet and Google Maps. You can set them from team options, map, map settings. If Google Maps will be selected, you will need to create and add a Google Maps API key. The last header option is video header. Once you select video header, you will have options to upload videos in different formats. I will upload an MP4 video. I will select it from my device. This is the video. Insert into post. Next, you will be able to add a cover image for the video. You will be able to set it full screen. You can add a title, a subtitle, set video height, set an overlay color and set the color opacity. The video will show on front end. These are the header types available for pages and posts. Thank you for watching and please do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get instant notification on the latest videos.